I really satisfied with working in IBS. IBS has uh, uh, advanced facilities. I spent four years in post tech and I published my first structure paper in PNAS during I was in post tech. Later, I moved to Crate. Uh, I set up the X3 crystallography platform in our center, and finally, our center to publish a paper on the natural communication. Hi, my name is Yao Yao Fu. I'm from China. And now I work at IBS at the Center for uh, Biomolecular and Cellular Structure as a Senior Research Engineer. I work in structural biology, uh, mainly focus on the solving the protein structure. And now I also work for the uh, research support and lab management as a Senior Research Engineer. I got my PhD degree in China. And since my boyfriend, now who is my husband, he is pursued his PhD degree in KAIST. So I decided to move to Korea after my graduation. I spent four years in post tech and I published my first structure paper in PNAS during I was in post tech. And during that time, I devoted all my time to the research and I just come back to China only once for my wedding. Later, I moved to Korea. I joined a synthetic biology lab. So I was the only one who worked on the structural biology. Uh, I set up the X3 crystallography platform in our center and finally determined three kinds of protein structures. All of this work uh, helped our center to publish a paper on the natural communication. You know that. Natural Com is, is quite a good paper. Yeah. Uh, honestly, the most difficult decision in my life is whether I pursued my academic path in China or in Korea. So obviously, I find a, a good position that's very quite suited for me. I mean that in working in IBS, so I decided to live in Korea. I joined IBS mainly because of the Korea EM facilities. About five years ago, IBS installed the Korea EM platform. That's a kind of advanced microscopes. This microscope is the basic for these cryo-EM technologies. So at that time, there were only two or three in the whole country, I mean in Korea. Cryo-EM was a cutting-edge technology in our structural biology, this field. So I realized that if I could access to this cryo-EM technology, it will develop my research expertise. So for me, it's quite an easy decision to join the IBS. IBS has uh, uh, advanced facilities. We have Cryo EM, we have Cryo ET. This is only for my research field. Cryo ET is different from Cryo EM. It is the next generation method for the structural biology research. For Cryo ET, we can analyze the proteins just in native state. I mean, you can see, you can observe the protein in cell. So this is a cutting edge technology and IBS is installed this platform now. In other research fields, they also have the advanced facilities and they provide the enough scientific research fund and you can focus on your work. Don't worry about anything else. For a foreigner, they have the GHD, the Global Health Desk. This agent, we just call the GHD. They always send us some uh, useful daily information to the international researchers, and they organize kind of a lot of kind of, uh, I mean, activities. 
to help the international researchers to adapt their life in Korea. And also, I, I, I like this agent and also I try to involve in their activities. And finally, actually, I receive a reward from the uh, Taizhen administrator. They will help the foreigner to set up your life and the work in Korea. That's really helped a lot for me. Even though the initial reason I came to Korea because of my boyfriend, because of love, but later I realized that Korean is quite a good place for my develop my academic path. I really satisfied with working in IBS. The most memorable things for me by working in Korea is that the top structure biologist, no matter younger or older generation, they all at the forefront and they keep adapting their technologies. Sometimes it's not easy things. So that's the thing that really impressed me the most. I think most of the foreigner will say the faster, the better culture. So for example, people want the tasks finished quickly, but still with high quality. Yeah, I, this, type, this kind of things actually pushed me to improve my technical skills. And also, when you start a new project, the boss always want to begin right away instead of setting everything ready. They will suggest, just go and adjust your direction. I think this kind of way will help me to find, quite quickly find the right direction of my research. It's a quite ex a positive ex experience for me to working in Korea. I have a quite clear goals. The structure biology have processed several development. As initially, we used the X-ray crystallography to determine the crystal structure of protein. And later, we move on to the Corel EN for analyze the protein single particle. And now, recently, a cutting-edge technology called Corel EP has emerged. So IBS now is setting up this Corel EP platform. My goal is to use this platform to do my uh, do the protein structure study and later publish the high quality paper in the next five years. I have quite positive experience in Korea as a foreigner, so don't be afraid of to come to Korea. Even these countries speak Korean, but there is definitely no problem if you use English in this country. And this country is quite open and welcome the international researchers. So if you want to develop your academic, academic path or you just want to live here, this they're really a good choice.